should I have healed before this? Probably. They probably will auto heal me if I don't do this now, but I think I should just do that just in case. And I don't think I have a terror orb, do I? Would you like to enter the Academy Ace Tournament? Miss Kiara, it's championing trainer, right? Okay, y'all register as a contestant. Please head down to the battle court. Let's do this. See if I get any special item. Even if it's just like candy or something. Welcome one and all to another thrilling Academy Ace tournament. Let's get right to it and kick off the first round. Who will the fates pair up today? Champion Kiara will be facing... The Cook of Legends Arvin from Class 2G. Alright, why are you of all people? I've got one shot at this. I can't blow it. I'm really hoping Nimona will show up in this. I mean, they implied that she will be um, in the next Academy Ace tournament. So. I'm I'm hoping. Instead of instead of uh, Gita. Remember Gita battled me last time? Instead of her. I'm hoping Nimona will show up. We'll see. Boom! Crushed. Destroyed. Okay, Sko villain. Uh, bring it. It is a fire type as well, so I need to watch out for that. But I could do U-turn. Oh wow, almost. Let's send up Palmont to get attacked by Sko villain. And let's finish it off. Not bad. Quick attack it. It's crazy how I still have that move. Literally all throughout the playthrough, I never got rid of that move. And it's like so weak too. But I never got rid of it because there just weren't any other moves that I liked <laughs> that Palmot could learn. There just weren't any other moves. Alright, let's do this. Okay, that's three down. I think three more to go. Toad Squirrel. Okay. I don't know what type that is, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. This one is super effective, so let's try it. Good. Okay. Sign up Palma again just because I have to. Send out someone new since I used the uh, thing. Oh, and it's the cloister next, too, so that's great. Alright, I could use Discharge to just completely wreck you. And then that's five down. One more to go, which should be Mbostiff. Nice. Think you've got us on the run? Not at all, little buddy. This is when we turn it around and shine. Okay. Let's try ourselves a discharge. My boss, the time to terrestrialize. No one can ever outshine you.
Okay. Ooh, paralyzed. Okay. Super effective, sure, but it didn't defeat me. There it is. Did it. Must have really gave it his all. I know he did, and next time we won't lose. Whatever you say. And the winner of this first round battle is Champion Kiara. <laughs> Guess getting pitted up against my little buddy was just my bad luck. Next up in the second round, I'm sure you're ready to hear the matchup, so let's get to it. Kiara will be facing... <gasps> Ooh, the XR Ordinary Hacker is Penny from Class 1D. I didn't battle her last time. M my VVs and I won't back down, even up against you. I did not battle her last time. Alright. I get to battle Penny one more time. It's great. Alright, let's go, Miascarada. You got healed up. Play rough. Nice. Leafy on. Let's keep current Pokemon. Avoided it. What? I'm terrestrialized. My speed should be up. <laughs> My accuracy should be up. Okay. Not as strong as I wanted it to be. We're good, though. It's fine. Another play rough. Flareon. Yeah, let's switch for that. Miss and dig destroyed. Vaporeon. I'll definitely keep current Pokemon out. Discharge. What? You actually survived that? That's not supposed to happen. That wasn't supposed to happen. You're not supposed to survive that. Jolteon. Um, let's go ahead and switch to Miascarada. Or you know what? I could have used Dig. I completely forgot I had that move. We'll see. Let's try a flower chick. Nice. That is how it's done. How many more do you have? Uh, no, you are not learning that. Sylveon. 
Okay. You always have to go all out, don't you? In a good way, I mean. One more flower trick. Time to terrestrialize, become who you really want to be, and shine like the twinkling stars. It's funny when <laughs> they're terrestrializing, they're always like s overwhelmed by the power that's emanating from that orb. They're just like, eh, and then they just hold it out. It's funny. Literally, every single one is like that. Every single person that could terrestrialize and has terrestrialized is like that. The gym leaders, Nimona, they're all like overwhelmed by the power at first. But not me. Not me. I hold it up into the air. And then I, j I just let it do its thing. <laughs> My VV power wasn't enough. I love how she calls it that. My VV power. That's cute. And the winner of the second round is champion Kiara. Crazy strong as always, but you know what? I'm proud of you. If Penny was here, that must mean Mona's here too, right? Finally, only four trainers remain. Time for our contestants to face the third matches, everyone. Champion Kiara will be facing... Ooh! Our very own home economics teacher, the gruff yet homie, Mr. Saguero. I am pleased to be facing you in battle. Now allow me to show you my skills. I haven't fought him yet either. This is my very first battle with him. That's crazy. Pachirisu. Oh, how cute. Level 65 Pachirisu. I've never seen that before. Let's start off by terrestrializing. Alright, Pachirisu. Get dead. Nice. Frostlass. Uh, grass type isn't so good against me. Or, I mean, I'm not so good against it. But, uh... I could still potentially win... With a critical hit and same type attack bonus. I could try. Nice. That was great. Vespaquin. Bug is not very... F <laughs> I'm not good against Bug either. Uh, so this time I'm going to switch. Let's go with Palm Up. Kama is only at, um, is almost at level 100. Let's get him there. I don't know why. Let's just get him there. <laughs> Might as well, right? All right, Vespa Quinn. Discharge. Nice. Okay then. Gudra. Uh, let's switch for Gudra. Because I have a fairy type attack that should work for Gudra. God, Gudra was such a pain to get a hold of when I was completing my Pokedex. <laughs> because the way Gudra evolves, it's another one time evolution thing that Pokemon has going on. The way uh, Sligu would evolve into Gudra is it has to reach a certain level and it has to be raining. It has to be raining in your game for it to um, work. So, yeah, no other Pokemon evolves like that. It's pretty crazy. So, in the end, I never ended up evolving it like that because it never rained in my game whenever I wanted it to. It never rained in my game, so... I ended up trading 
I ended up trading with someone to get a Gudra. I remain calm despite the circumstances. I must stand firm. You must. You must. Let us do this adorably. Hatterene, it is time to terrestrialize. <laughs> you guys see that? Literally his eye like flinched because of the ultimate power in that orb. He just couldn't like handle it at first and then he got used to it. <laughs> That's what happens with everyone. It just it just really shows you how powerful that orb is. And that you should watch out for that orb. <laughs> should be careful. Nice. I wonder if I take the tournament again, I'll get different people. Perhaps the secret to your strength is a balanced diet? Perhaps. I wonder if, like, if I keep taking it over and over again, it'll just cycle through, like, all the teachers, including the nurse. <laughs> Maybe Professor Clavel will be there. It'll just cycle through everyone. What can I say in the face of such strength? I should have expected no less from a champion. That'd be crazy. You could literally battle everyone. There's one last match in this tournament, ladies and gentlemen. These two trainers will be facing off to finally determine who's the strongest in the academy. Champion Kiara will be facing... Ah, oh, seriously, I don't want to fight you again. I decided to throw my hat in the ring once more. Show me the fruits of your training. I wanted to see Nimona. No fair. <laughs> I got two new people though, so I, I'm I'm pretty happy about that. But I wanted to fight Nimona again. All right, let's do this. I'm starting off with a U-turn, which is weird, but it's super effective, so it works. <laughs> Alright. Sure. I sent it out just because I need to send out something. So I'll go ahead and switch when it asks me if I want to switch. Go Goat. Uh, Go Goat? I can use U turn again on Go Goat. I guess I'll do that. Super effective against Go Goat. Nice. I'm just going to show off all of my mythical Pokemon to all of these people. <laughs> That's what's going to happen. So, I showed off uh, Wochain. Next is Ting Lu. Check it out, everyone. Check it out. Look at this awesome Pokemon. That is not so much pretty. It's not so pretty. <laughs> when I want it to be pretty. Alright. I've destroyed so many of the losers in my past. I got this. <laughs> this I've killed so many. Memento? What the heck is that? I don't know what that even is. The user faints. In return, the target's attack and special attack are harshly lowered. Uh, no. <laughs> the user faints. Just to lower the attack of the other Pokemon? I don't like that. 
I don't like that. Oh, shoot. That was a lot. Inferno. Now that's a, a move that is worth it. Oh, no, it isn't. <laughs> Accuracy 50. <laughs> No way. I am not doing accuracy 50. It's not happening. Sorry. I had to sneeze. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, I don't think this is gonna work. So, let's do U-turn. To make sure that Miascarada doesn't faint. Doesn't faint on me. Let's go with Palmat. Alright. Here I come. Glamora. Right? I see you haven't been slacking off. You're an inspiration to all champions of Paldea. Alright, level 70. I could dig on this one as well. Become the light that shines on all who reach the pinnacle, Glamora. Oh wow, she is confident in that. I think she's the only one in having her Pokemon Tarasla. She is. She does not flinch at all. I mean, it makes sense. She's the champion. So, I don't know if Nimona doesn't, but Nimona might flinch as well. I don't know. But, um, Gita does not flinch. Toxic debris. Ooh, earth power. Yikes. Alright, let's try a discharge. To finish it off. You are the light that shines upon the people of Paldea. I'm taking a lot of money from these people. <laughs> the future of Paldea is secure with you, I see. This, this was a fine victory. Congratulations. And the winner of this tournament is... Champion Kiara! Kiara, Kiara, Kiara. <laughs> Why was Nimona not in that battle? Congratulations on your victory. Here's your well-earned prize. Three ba- <laughs> That's not well-earned at all. I hope to see you in your tournament again soon. <laughs> that was not well at- <laughs> That was not well-earned at all. That was awful. That's an awful prize. I don't like it. <laughs> Anyways, I think that's what I'm going to have to call it. Let's see. Let me get a good pose in front of the school first. Good pose in the center of this diamond. Too far. In the center of this diamond. There you go. <laughs> well, everyone. That has been uh, Pokemon Violet. We finish all of the post-game stuff now that you guys could as well do. 
uh, we battled all of the gym leaders again. We battled all the Team Star bosses again. We took on the Academy Ace Tournament twice, battling a total of one, two, three, four, five, six. Six? Was that six? Six different people, because we got Penny and the other teacher this time. Last time, we had to battle Jacques and another teacher. And this time we battled Penny and Arvin. So, six total people. New people. I wonder if the third time Nimona will show up, but I won't be doing it a third time. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, yeah, you guys could as well do the post-game stuff. There's not much to it. But I think I'd... I've finished it. And I think, honestly... I think I'm calling it here. I won't be shiny hunting. You guys, if you go subscribe to my Kiara Plays Live channel, which is in the description below, I will, um, you'll be able to see me, uh, on stream when this was recorded and see how hard I struggled with the shiny hunting. You guys will see how hard I struggled with the shiny hunting. It literally took four hours, and I could not find a single one. So, yeah, just thinking of that, I think I'm calling it here. I think I am calling it here. I won't be shiny hunting at all anymore in this game. I was hoping to at least get, you know, three or four <laughs> shinies, but I could not. So... Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be shiny hunting anymore. It's sad. So, I think I've actually finished this game then. I think I'm fully done with the post-game stuff. I will return to this game, of course, when there's like DLC or like special terror raids that you guys want me to do. You guys let me know. If you guys want me to do special terror raid battles that are 7 stars, then I will do that. But other than that, I think that's been it. This has been the... um the final finale of my series of Pokemon Violet. So, thank you guys again so much for watching. I will see you in some other Nintendo game. I will see you guys there.